Hello, preschool. Um, I am going to read you a story, one of our Amber Lamb stories, about kindness. And I hope that you'll listen and enjoy the story and see what you can learn from it. The story is called Amber Shows Kindness. Amber Lamb and Button Bear were playing ball in Amber's front yard when Amber's mother came out the front door. Amber, called her mother. Mrs. Penguin called and needs someone to help her find Katie Kitten. She was keeping Katie for the day, and now she can't find her. Okay, we'll help, said Amber, Liam, and Button Bear. They walked down to the corner where Mrs. Penguin lived. Oh, said Mrs. Penguin, I'm so happy you're here. Katie Kitten is lost. She was playing outside. But she didn't answer when I called her to lunch. We'll find her, said Amber Liam. Down the sidewalk they went, calling for Katie Kitten. They looked under the bushes, behind the trees. They looked at the park by the swings and the slide. But they didn't find Katie. Let's walk back to Mrs. Penguin and tell her we can't find Katie, said Amber. We'll look for her along the way. Again, they checked all the yards, the bushes, and the trees. As they walked in Mrs. Penguin's backyard, they heard a very quiet <coughs> Katie, Katie, where are you? They called. They looked around the rose bushes. They looked around the fish pond and in the garage. They even looked near Mrs. Penguin's apple tree. And near the apple tree, the meows got louder and louder. Amber Lamb and Button Bear looked up, and there in the apple tree was Katie Kitten looking down at them. She looked very sad and very scared. Mrs. Penguin! Mrs. Penguin! called Amber Lamb as she ran to the door. We found her! We found her! Come and see! She's in your apple tree! Mrs. Penguin followed Amber Lamb to the apple tree. Then... She heard Katie Kitten meowing. Come down, Katie, said Mrs. Penguin. I think she's too scared, said Button Bear, but I'll go up and get her. Button Bear climbed the apple tree. He gave Katie Kitten a friendly smile. You guys have a nice smile. Button Bear said, climb on my back and hold on tight and I'll take you down. Katie did just what Button Bear said. Before she knew it, she was safe in Mrs. Penguin's arms. How kind you were, said Mrs. Penguin to Amber Lamb and Button Bear. Thank you so much for helping me find my Katie. Button Bear and Amber Lamb went home. Mother, mother, I'm home, said Amber Lamb. We found Katie Kitten for Mrs. Penguin. I am very proud of you, said Mother. You did a kind thing today. Hopefully, maybe you were are like Amber Lamb and maybe you were doing have been doing something that you wanted before, maybe playing something you liked and someone needed help. And I hope that you would be like Amber Lamb in our story and go and help somebody else, even if it had meant you had to stop what you were doing, because it's always nice to think of others before ourselves. We have a Bible verse to go along with our story. It's Ephesians 4.32. It says, be ye kind one to another. I hope that while you're home, you're being kind to those around you.